Hey Space Lab, I'm Jake and welcome to the very first episode of, well, we don't have a title yet, but each week we're going to discuss some of the coolest space related news and videos. So if you have a title for the show that you think is both adequate and awesome, leave it in the comments below. But in the meantime, let's get started. One of the largest solar flares ever hit Earth Thursday, March 8th. NASA has an amazing video of the solar flare. In the video, you can see the surface of the sun actually ripple from the force of the eruption. If you can't get enough flare, Space.com has an amazing photo gallery of solar flares and sunstorms. Now let's go about 890 million miles away from the sun to Saturn, specifically Saturn's moon, Dion. Astronomers have recently discovered that Dion has oxygen in its atmosphere. But on Earth, we have oxygen because of plants and trees. So how does Dion have it? National Geographic has an article answering just that. A lot of people have been leaving comments asking about black holes in our Ask Michael videos. Well, Michael Stevens just came out with an incredible video all about black holes and light speed on Vsauce. I can't begin to tell you how amazing this video is. If you haven't seen it, go check it out right now. And if you have seen it, dust off your monocle, because you're a genius. Google Sky allows you to explore the stars. You can look at constellations, the planets in our solar system, but one of the most interesting aspects is the Hubble Showcase, which lets you interact with images from Hubble, and it gives you a description of what each galaxy, cluster, or nebula is. But if you feel like watching a video of the sky, Randy Halverson from DakotaLapse.com made an incredible time-lapse video called Temporal Distortion. It has incredible footage of the Milky Way, the Aurora, meteors, and much more that we usually can't see with the naked eye. It's out of this world. Lastly, I'm going to leave you with a video by YouTuber Vinciverse, who built a space shuttle out of Legos and then sent it to space. Links to everything we talked about are in the description below, so check them out. Send me messages with cool space stuff that you found and hopefully we'll be able to feature it. Also, don't forget, leave comments with ideas for the show name. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.